What's going on guys? Tactical Bacon here and welcome to what is hopefully going to be the first of many uh, live introductions. Uh, today we're going to be playing a little bit of Nether. Uh, it's actually on Steam for I believe it was $9.99, so $10 uh, US dollars, I guess, just in case you're German and you're like, how much is it? That was, that was actually a really, really bad German accent. Um, sorry about that. Like I said, we're going to be going over a few things here and there. Uh, I will be picking up a gun, but you'll see all that kind of stuff. Um, and then at the end, we're going to come back to me being here, I guess you could say. And uh, I'm going to give you some pros, cons. I do try to go over some pros and cons in the video, actually, but I don't manage to get to any cons. So we'll go ahead and do a pros and cons list at the very end. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Seemed like it spawned me outside of the world. Unless things just haven't rendered in. Something. There's the city over there, but what is this? I mean, we could just look at the map. Oh, wow. I spawned all the way over here. Um. have no idea where to go. So that's uh that's gonna be an issue. Seeing as I have no idea where I'm at. But uh let's let's go figure out I guess. Holy shit. What the fuck is that? Alright, so there's a couple. There's a couple of nether. nether fuckers out there. And then one on that building. Alright, here's one coming right at me. So, let's. let's do the unimaginable. Wasn't that hard? I feel pretty confident about taking on more. I'm sure if you didn't see them, then they would probably scare you a little bit more, but... Like if they just like randomly popped out of the ground in front of you. can't say that this is... <clears throat> okay. I was waiting for my stamina to build back up because... Oh my fucking god. What the hell is that? Dude, that thing is gonna kill me. It's a gorilla. That thing is gonna kill me. I'm... I'm... Gonna... Stay away from that guy. He looks like he's in a bad, bad mood. All right, so I don't know. I mean, like, just from this distance, it looks like things aren't rendering out properly, even though they they might be. Um, I mean, really, for for a ten dollar game, I mean, I'm 
I didn't really expect much going into it, really. But, um... I don't know. Hopefully I'm going to come down here and find something. Hopefully rocks are not as glitchy. Okay, so they can... They can go on the water. So that's 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 a thing. It's an interesting fact. Shit. Fuck, I'm kind of in a predicament here. And I guess I can crouch walk. Okay. I hope I'm okay. <laughs> I hope I didn't trigger that guy to come back down here. Okay, the the grass is just kind of floating in the air, so don't really don't really pay too much attention to that. Uh, let's see. I mean, I could say getting the higher ground may provide me with a better vantage point. Um, I guess we can go ahead and start going over some of the pros and cons to this game so far. Um, pro number one, it's, it's in a big city. Uh, it's not all in the forest. Uh, it mostly takes place in the city, and I, I really do like that because it has kind of a a Fallout 3 kind of feel to it. Um, the, the, the game itself definitely has some, some bugs, as you can kind of tell from, uh, from the screen jerking around every time I go down or up and down these stairs. Uh, let's see. The, uh, another pro is the, uh, oh shit. While, while the graphics aren't completely and totally up to par, um, it, it does run pretty smooth. I mean, I'm getting about 50, 52 frames a second here, and that's in combat with this, uh, crazy teleporting fucker. So. Whoa, what? This guy just has just guns on him. Oh, that is that is sick. And he has all this other shit on him too. All right, so let's let's uh let's not do that. Let's uh let's go ahead and take a look at some of the shit that we got here. Um, okay, how can we, uh, is it already loaded? I don't know, let's, uh, let's give it a shot on something. Because, I mean, I don't want to attract any of them, but, I mean, if I come across one, then I'll, I'll literally give it a shot. Okay, that's kind of cool. We can get up here. Alright. Um, sorry, I, I got kind of off track there. Uh, I was going over the pros to the game. Um, so, like I said, you know, while the graphics aren't really up to par, uh... They are uh, very glitchy and stuttery at times. Um, things do look pretty good. I mean, look at these bricks right here. I mean, those are those are ten out of ten bricks right there. Um, uh, 
Alright, I got a feeling somebody's been here already. So we're just going to jump back down and uh, keep looking around. Uh, let's see, another pro of the game is uh, it's 10 bucks, so you know it's cheap. If you guys are... Oh shit, I almost fell. I don't know if a fall... I'm pretty sure a fall from that distance would... Uh, what? Would at least stun my guy, at least. Um, but yeah, another pro to the game is it's 10 bucks, so you're not really missing out on too much unless, you know, you don't have a job or a steady source of income, then, you know, 10 bucks may... 10 bucks may mean a lot more to you than if you were to have just an extra $10 you can throw. But, uh, yeah. Um cheap game, so, let's see, I want to see if I can test this out on a nether, or whatever the fuck you want to call these creatures, I'm sure they have technical names, like Reaper and all that kind of shit, Okay, this is the safe zone. Alright. Well, I don't really care to go to the safe zone. Shit, where'd it go? 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 There we go. I gotta get out of here because they're probably alerted players. If they're already around right now. Not exactly sure how loud the guns actually are in this game. Whoa! Holy shit! Oh my god! Holy shit, holy shit. Die! Holy fuck! Is there another one? Oh, Jesus Christ. Really? Okay, um... I, I don't know what I would need these for, so I'm just gonna drop them. So, uh, 
it's probably not a good idea to use your gun in very many situations. Unless you absolutely need to. Um, I guess now I just gotta find some more pistol ammo. I'll be fine. See, and then that's kind of another thing, is like if you find the, uh, the ammo, you don't necessarily need to find like a clip or anything like that. So that's kind of a good thing. Holy shit! Oh my god. <laughs> that was that big gorilla fucker that I didn't want to piss off. Somehow he caught up with me, I guess. Oh, that sucks too, because I found a good amount of gear on that run. Huh. So, you're probably thinking to yourself, pros and cons to Nether? What are they? I'm going to tell you straight up. The pros... First of all, it's $10, so you can't really go wrong there. Uh, for $10, I would definitely buy it. They do have other options on there uh, for different in-game items, I believe. Uh, you have an option for $14. Uh, I mean, it's $14.99, so $15, uh, $20, and I believe there might be a $25 in there. I'm not exactly sure, but the base price of the game is $10, so you can't really go wrong. Uh, does the game have its share of bugs and glitches? Yes, it does. I'm not going to lie, it does. But it's not as bad as some open-world survival games I've played. Hint, hint. So overall, would I recommend this game to anybody? It depends if you're going to uh, suggest this game to someone who's really set in their ways about how they want the game to look and perform then I would probably say that they should probably not get Nether. Uh, it's not going to be the thing for them. But if you're just looking for a couple of hours of entertainment, then I would definitely suggest getting this game. It's worth the $10 for a couple of hours here and there. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you've enjoyed it, and I hope you've enjoyed the kind of live stuff we got going on here. If you did, let me know in the comment section down below. I would really appreciate it. Also, if you have not subscribed to the channel, why haven't you? There's going to be a button up here somewhere or another where you can just click on that subscribe. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will catch you in the next one.